Your mom sure knows how to throw a weight. It's a really nice evening. It's nice to see everyone relaxing after the funeral. Yeah, that we're telling some pretty amazing stories about Victor. Victor does some cra pretty crazy things. But he always came through at the end. Almost always. Yeah, you're gonna have to tell me that one about how he rescued you from that kidnapper in New York again. That was awesome. No, I've gotta tell you about it tomorrow. This has been the longest day of my life, and I just wanna go to bed. Of course. You got it. I wouldn't have been able to make it through today without you. I'm just glad I was able to be here for you. Thank you. Damn! I wish I had my camera. What are you doing with that sleaze? Why would you bring him here? <sighs> take it easy. So I'll take a deep breath. I come in peace and also as a legitimate businessman. Really? Okay, you have doubts, I get that. But as I've told you, I've given up the erotic film Melu. That is French. Although, this setting would be perfect for hold the microphone. That would I don't care what you're doing here, I want you gone. Yeah, you heard him, man. Go take a walk. No, Star, will you please call off your gorilla here? You did Rick. not just refer to my boyfriend as a gorilla. Just hear me out. Rick and I had a good meeting, and he thinks we should reconsider letting him produce our single. Well, yeah, I got that. Is that why you weren't at my dad's? Damn it, my uncle, your uncle too, his, his burial service, you're hanging out with this idiot instead? Ooh, harsh. Now, I understand Rick might not be your favorite person, but I'm asking oh. you to keep an open mind. Please, Star, this is important to me, okay? And I understand, you know, Rick, once you get to know him, he's really not a bad guy. Not a bad guy. Baz, are you kidding me? You know what? Let me ask you something, all right? Are you crazy or are you just plain stupid? Did you forget how he hurt Danny, your cousin, when he blackmailed her boyfriend, my brother, into making that sleazy piece of trash movie? I remember, and what happened was regrettable. Regrettable? Mm -hmm. Oh, oh I, whoa, ho hold on. Hold the Diploma was not trashy. It was a perfect example of its genre. And hey, I had to do what I had to do to make money. I mean, correct me if I'm wrong, but didn't you used to steal cars before you became a self-righteous Jackass. Who the hell do you think you Whoa. are talking about? Hey, hey, hey. It's okay. It's I okay. Will. Stop. Yeah. Yeah, you're right. I used to steal cars. Because if I didn't, my dad would have beat the crap out of me. Now, what's your excuse? That's very sad. Cry me a river. Oh, what is going on, Baz? I told you that I did not want to work with this guy. Are you going to tell her, Baz? Tell me what? It's too late. Baz already signed the contracts. Tell me something, Baz. How do you sign a contract that I don't agree to? Because it's what's best for us. Both of us. And I honestly believe that Rick is the right producer. Are you serious? He believes in us, Star. He believes in our song. And he's got great ideas. He's got ideas that'll make the song better instead of just change it and put his own stuff on it. Baz, he's an extortionist and a pornographer. But he is also the only person who's responded to our CD. And we sent it to how many? Besides, I think we should at least give him a chance. Just because he's the only producer that responded doesn't mean that he is the right one. We can find a legit producer that is interested in us. I am legit. Shut, Shut up, up, and you went behind my back. Look, if you don't want to be involved, fine. Just give me my song and back uh, out. I'm not giving... Those are my vocals. And, and it's my music. No, this might just be a hobby for poor little rich girl, but this is my dream. And if it's not your dream, then forget it. If you don't want to work with Rick, fine. Sign over the rights to me, and I will. You don't know who I am. How dare you accuse me of not taking this seriously? You think that music is just a hobby for me? That this isn't my dream, too? If it was your dream, why haven't you done anything about it until now? You know what, Rick? Because a couple things got in the way, like having a child. Sorry. You don't say that I've wanted this for my entire life? My dad wasn't around when my mom was pregnant with me, but he came back and he cared for me, he loved me, and he told me to always chase, to always follow the star that I was named after, to chase after my dreams, and now he's back, he's back in my life, but I lost my uncle, who I loved, who I will never see again. Both of those men told me to never give up, to never stop fighting for what I believe in, to never back away from a fight, and I won't, I will never give up on that dream.
you're not gonna let them down, okay? Hey, 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 listen. You're gonna be a star. Just like you wrote on that present. Just maybe not with a song. No, maybe, maybe give this one to Baz and then to hell with them. Star, you have, you have so much music inside of you. So much. And you were too good to work with these lowlifes. Baz. I'm not signing over the rights. But I can't use your vocals if you yes, don't. Yes, you can. The damage is done, right? And if you think that he can do something with our music, if you trust this guy with it, then all right, let's do it. Really? You're cool with it? No, I'm not cool with it. I'm far from cool with it. What's the worst that can happen? What do we have got to lose, you know? If he ruins the song, then no one will hear it. I guarantee you that's not going to happen. This is the last time you make any move that affects me behind my back. Understand? And you, I do not want any sleazy business from you. I'm on to you. Star, are you sure about this? Yeah. Yeah, I have to be. If, if I want my dreams to come true, then I, they might as well start here. Thank you, Star. You made the right choice. We'll rock. Okay. Look, I, just, I personally want to thank you. You will not regret this. I better not. And don't worry. You'll have a little time to get used to the idea. What? What do you mean? I got a gig in Paris. Now? I mean, timing wasn't great for this anyway, right? We'll work on it when I get back. I guess. So, Baz and I need to finalize the contracts. Sayonara. Adieu. Konnichiwa. That's Japanese. Don't worry, Star. It's gonna be awesome. Well, I'm glad that's settled. James. Star, I've gotta go meet Bobby. No, I know you don't think it's a good idea. It doesn't matter what I think. It does matter what you think. No, the only thing that matters is you following your dream. Star, it's your life. It's your career. I never... I never stop you from doing what you want. I love you. I love you too.